Hello and welcome to our instructional series of videos. In this installment, we're going to show you how to install a PCIe card in the OWC Mercury Helios Thunderbolt enclosure. For this installation, we'll be putting in an OWC Excelsior Pro Q, but most standard PCIe cards will also work. Make sure to check out the Helios webpage for more information on compatibility. We've already gathered our materials and are working on a soft, static-free work surface. We're now ready to begin. The first step is to loosen the two thumb screws on the back of the Helios enclosure. You should now be able to remove the inner tray by pushing on the rear of the enclosure, then pulling the tray out of the outer case. There are two retaining screws that can help hold your card in place. Start by removing the innermost one, as that's where the main card sits. You can use your fingers, but it may be easier to use a small Phillips screwdriver as shown here. If you're installing a single width card, that's all you need to worry about. If you're installing a double width card, you'll also need to remove the second screw and slot cover. The OWC Excelsior Pro Q is a single width card, so we've only removed the single screw, but a dual width card will install similarly. The notch in the PCIe card will line up with the pin in the Helios's slot, and the bottom tip of the card's backplate will line up with the notch in its corresponding spot. Gently push the card into place, making sure all pieces sit flush. Then, line up the notch in the card's backplate with the screw hole in the Helios and replace the retaining screw to hold the card in place. Some PCIe cards require extra power to run. If your card doesn't need this, you can skip this step. If your card does require power, such as with the Excelsior Pro Q, you'll need a special cable, which is available separately. Make sure the SATA power connector is attached to the card in the appropriate spot, then line up the other connector with this socket near the bottom of the Helios and slide the two together until they're seated securely. It's now time to close up your Helios. First, make sure all cables are positioned so they sit inside the inner tray. Then, slide the tray back into the outer enclosure until it sits flush. Finally, tighten the two rear thumb screws. Your OWC Mercury Helios Thunderbolt enclosure is now ready to use.